here with it now. No. No. No, it doesn't seem to be functional. It's a 308. Yeah. They are. They are notorious for this particular circuit errors. What would you recommend? Yeah. Well, I don't know. I'll give it a check over. See if we can return it to active duty. take my time with it. These old models are, they need a delicate touch, don't they? Yeah. I'd like to salvage this unit if I can, from the exterior. It seems to be in reasonable condition. I do, I do. I've got it all here. I've got a few here. No, I think I've got everything I need. Okay. I'll update you. Still no. No activity. No voltage. Just see some illumination behind your optical circuit. Minimum voltage. Okay, maybe we can salvage this unit after all. Good. That's very, very good. Yeah.
position of these joints are actually surprising, surprisingly good for a droid of your era. Let's just take that off completely. See if we can discover what lies beneath. that your central functions are actually okay. I've been optimistic before. It's much more, much more interesting to work with a model such as yourself. It's much more of a challenge than the newer ones. such a job. It's me. Uh, not bad. I've discovered that there is some remaining power in the optical circuits. Yeah, that's why I said too. I think this one can be safe. 
after all. I think you're being silly. Sentient? No. No. I don't think there's any chance that this model could be sentient. I certainly haven't seen any indication of that so far. No, no, no. I could do the test if you want. To rule it out, I can do that. I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't mind, I'll do it if you want. Yeah. I'm um, not sure, probably another 20 minutes. Half an hour, maybe. Sure, I'm very, very thorough. Very thorough with it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, my friend, I've been uh, asked to perform a sentience check on you. good droid engineers talk to ourselves from time to time, so I suppose uh, that's normal. If you can identify this object, please blink your optical circuitry two times. This is one of your faceplate bolts. The end is quite sharp. I'm going to put it into your optical lens now. If you are sentient, you should flinch. the lubrication of your upper servo mechanism. Now, this should take about 12 seconds before your upper servo mechanism is essentially drying out. Six. see how's the focus on my hand you can still focus on my face focus on my hand and focus on my face <laughs> I don't expect you to respond How does that feel? Was that just a fluke? Um. Okay. 
How does that feel? That sound you just made, can you please make it again? Okay. Would you like me to detach the clamp from your lubrication hose? You should feel the lubrication flowing back into your upper servo now. And if you can understand me, I just want you to know that I'm really sorry. A 308 at your age. And with the greatest of respect in your state of disrepair, although moderate, I didn't think there was a chance that you could possibly be sentient, so... <laughs> wow. Okay. Um going to believe this. I think our little 308 here is in fact aware and sentient. No, it didn't blink. It made a variety of sounds with its medium mechanism just below its chin. At least I think that's what it was. Hmm. Yeah, well, we're definitely not going to be wiping or reprogramming anything here. This, this is remarkable. This is the first time I've heard of this. We'll have to do some further digging to see just what experiences this machine has had. This unit has clearly been exposed to something in its existence which has created a capacity or spark or something more it could be this is what we've been looking for all this time I am I'm excited I am excited now I just need to carefully replace all the plates that I took off. Mm, don't worry, I'll be careful. Yeah. I'll be very, 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 very careful with this unit. Listening to me this whole time. That's truly remarkable. Well, I think maybe we should put you back together. What do you think? <laughs> All right then.
Is that okay? How does that feel? Right, I thought that. It looks like the top ones could be a little tighter, but I don't want to force them in, so I'll use the drill. Come back, you are whole again. Although I still don't know exactly why you can't speak, but I promise you, we're not going to rip you apart to find out. We are going to treat you with the utmost care and respect that Ascension 308 deserves. So, you have nothing to fear here. We are going to look after you. And if you like, you could even stay here with us afterwards, okay? But, that's up to you. You have the freedom to decide that yourself. Either way, I want to welcome you into our little family.